I'm Jasmine of Join Motion Photography and today I'm going to show you how to make a do-it-yourself sandbag for your light stand. Just like this. It's about 10 pounds. It will fit over your light stand really stably and right in the center and also you can use it as a newborn posing pillow. To start we will need some scrap material something that's a little bit thicker. This is kind of like a fake suede, but you can use any kind of uh, old drapes or things like that you have scrap lying around. Some scissors, we need a template, sewing machine, some needle and thread, and some sand. So first thing I had to do was make the template out of the cardboard. Uh, it wasn't very hard, I just needed to cut out like a part of a plate and then I used that to copy and make the same size for each of the petals. Um, I cut it so that it is exactly the size I want it to be for my light stand. So you have to remember to leave a bit of room around the edge. Next, you need to draw the template. So uh, make sure you leave a little bit of room around the edge. Like I said, you want to be able to sew it uh, so it reverses. And then I'm going to trace. But, like I said, I need some space around the edges, so I'm just going to make a quick kind of sketch around the edge. Next, we cut out the pattern. Okay, I just cut a little line in the, um, in the fabric, just so that when it goes around the light stand, it'll actually center itself around it really nicely. Okay, so next thing is we zigzag stitch. The reason we do that is that you don't want the edges to fray so that there might be a hole one day and the sand just pours out of it. After we, we have zigzag stitched all of the uh, sides, I didn't do a really great job, but it doesn't really matter. Line it up together and have this is supposed to be the outside. So the outside will go in. Then, after we line it all up, I take some pins and I'm going to pin it together so that when I sew the final line, it will be uh, together. Once all of the, uh, the two sides are stitched together, we're going to sew along this line, which is now the line that I originally drew from the template. And I'm going to leave an opening of about this gap right here in order to reverse the, to turn it inside out. Next, you have your sewn all around and there's still a hole here. So what we're gonna do is we're going to reverse it. Okay, so next we're going to take a funnel and a measuring cup is always good just to scoop up the sand and I'm going to put it in one of the holes. Now that you're done filling up the sandbags, they're probably about the same weight in each side. You're going to take a needle and thread, nothing too big, and we're going to just sew up the hole. And cut it. And voila. Okay, so once again, I'm going to show you how to put the uh, sandbag onto your light stand. You just put one on each side and you can even drain the sand and then we have a good solid weight and that light stand's not going to topple. So once again, I'm Jasmine with Join Motion Photography. Thanks so much for watching.